Dan Moskal here, and we are talking about step 10 with writing your book and going through the editing process. And one of the important things, so first of all, we're going to look at uh, one of the books we've been working on here and talking about in these other steps. Um, the first couple pages are really, really, really important, and I can't stress this enough because of a few reasons. And let's go ahead and just look at the reasons exactly but let's go ahead and look at this book here email marketing that works I'm actually doing a free giveaway here if you visit damoskaluniversity.com and sign up for our marketing newsletter we will uh, give this book to you for free on the Kindle here and uh, we're doing it for Thanksgiving and then we may go ahead and leave it in uh, we'll show you that here in some other videos if you're curious you can probably find some more but here is the first beginning Here's also your description, and the first few pages are what really sells your book. So the description's here, and we should probably go in and actually try and clean up the formatting with this. Um, not sure why it's there's no spaces between it in, between any of it, but this is kind of a description, and then we personally have listed out just the table of contents. But also when you go and preview a book, you know, think about when you buy a book, and when you check things out, a lot of people will look at the table of contents, of course, and see what the chapters are. And they might even look at some of the first couple of pages. So in your first couple pages, it's really, really, really essential to interest and try and sell your book. That's a picture of my little nephew, by the way. <laughs> He's the sweetest little guy. Um, also, I do strongly encourage you to put your book at audible.com, which will... Uh, put your book also in iTunes in the Audible form, which is pretty cool. And I'll show you how to put it in the print form. Uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel, please. I think there's a video already, maybe. Uh, whatever the case, we're publishing this one here in just a few days, so we are making some more with that. But you can do an audio sample. This is a good way to distribute your book, by the way. Um, it really does well. So just as a, for an example... These first couple minutes, which chapter are... one, your number one goal. Listen, the bottom line with email marketing is it should be increasing your income. Go visit audible.com and check uh, out these samples if you're curious. But you really want to try and sell and interest and engage people and get them to say, Yeah, I want your book. And then, you know, you want them to actually read your book. But start thinking, and we're starting to think, and you do this stuff in whatever order you decide to do best, but we're really starting to think now about the title of our book, along with uh, the chapter titles, along with some of the sections, and like the table of contents, like creating the actual table of contents, because we haven't even really decided on our chapter titles in our book, really. We're just using kind of working chapter titles. We did come up and have been thinking about, you know, a title like Affiliate Marketing Revealed, The Blueprint to Affiliate Marketing, or uh, this one, maybe a variation of this might end up being the winner, How I Earned Seven Figures as a College Dropout with Affiliate Marketing. Uh, I think that one kind of speaks the most to me so far, but the point is just, you know, if you already have a title, great, but uh, if you don't, keep working on it, and I'm going to show you the process, because there actually is a process I use to one, choose a good keyword tool because I want this, these books to show up in the search engine results for when people search SEO training or email marketing strategies, for example. And also, when it shows up in the search results, there's some easy ways, but I usually make them keyword rich and we check the length of it too. I'll show you that here in another video. But don't stress that stuff too much if you're still thinking about it like I am. Just, you know, start thinking about it and start playing around with some things. Uh, the other th last thing we're going to mention here, this is the book we're working on with affiliate marketing. We're going to be pulling out kind of our sample because we're happy with the first whole, you know, section of this book, like the first nine chapters. We're, we're pretty happy with. And then the section two, we're going to kind of work a little bit on the flow of that here tonight and then we're still working really we have some ideas and have done a few things here for the last section but really kind of a way of wrapping it all together and you know whether you're doing affiliate marketing or your primary source is writing books which you know I doubt from royalties but whatever you're working as with your business and industry and stuff uh, 
the amount of service you provide <laughs> I'm sorry the amount of service you provide to other people people is in direct proportion to the amount of income you you earn just like Earl Nightingale says like there's so many other people that say the same thing but the more you help others and the more other people you can help you know the more income you're gonna earn in a general sense and really not just in a general sense but the amount of service you provide to other people is equivalent and in direct proportion to your income it's it's so true uh, so we want to tell people to kind of do more and do more service at the end of our book you know whatever it is that you're doing and whatever it is that you find working with affiliate marketing or you know some folks may never even use affiliate marketing but they might read the book but they could still benefit from hearing to be of more service with whatever you know that applies to every business I guess is what I'm really trying to say so check out our books we're at Am audible.com or at barnesandnoble.com we're also over at itunes or at amazon you can visit damnmoscoluniversity.com sign up for our free marketing newsletter we're also going to put a link in to our website down below for the uh, other seven tips to writing your book uh, in seven steps and check out our books at amazon we're also going to give you a free copy of our book email marketing that works here if you come and visit here soon uh, on the kindle and subscribe to our YouTube channel and looking forward to talking to you again soon. We're also going to go through some of the process of optimizing your YouTube channel. Uh, if you're also using video marketing, which I suggest you do if you are writing or have written a book to help with some of the promotions and marketing of your book. Uh, really, YouTube is a very effective way of getting and an effective tool to help get your message out along with all these other great people like Amazon, iTunes, Audible, and the audiobook is really cool. We're going to walk you through that process of creating that, which is fun, and I'm looking forward to already. So uh, please leave any specific questions, comments, or concerns below. Please like this video and share with your friends, family, colleagues. Have a great day and night, and looking forward to talking to you soon.